I'm kind of old. True. My life's kind of boring. Also true. But I'll film it anyway. No one asked for this. Hope you're ready for it, cause I'm blocking till Christmas Day. Oh my god, please never let me do that again. Hello everybody, welcome to Vlogmas number nine. We're already like three quarters of the way done. That's literally crazy. I have just gotten myself ready. It's actually like 4 p.m. ish right now, actually like 4.30. And we are doing a very fun night with our friends Josh and Noelle. We are going to Hogwarts. We're basically doing like a Universal Studios date night. We all have passes, so it's the holidays. It's all decorated. It's gonna be nice and fun. And actually we went for Halloween a couple months ago and it was really, really fun. But this time we like literally just wanna go into Hogsmeade, like go to the pub and get some drinks and just like literally have a date night. So they're actually gonna drive here to our house and then we're gonna Uber together to Universal Studios and I'm just getting dressed so now. What? I didn't say it, he did. So what I'm thinking, I'm I'm kind of going for like a Ravenclaw theme, but I don't it's like not blatant. So what I'm thinking, because it, it is gonna be kind of chilly, so I might have to do like leggings or tights underneath this, but I have this cute plaid sweater from, sweater? This is a skirt, from Uniqlo, and I haven't gotten to wear it yet. I actually brought it to England and never got to wear it. And then I also have this cute cardigan, and it's actually very thick. So I'm thinking if I wear something underneath it, like I'll be completely fine. Um, so that's sort of what I'm feeling, like a cute little, sort of like Hogwarts student vibe. So let's put this on and see how we feel about it. Oh, I also have my cute velvet ribbon. So it's just making me feel very like I'm a student at a school that's filled with magic. So, all right, let's put this on and then we'll figure out shoes. All right, here's what we've landed on. I'm gonna go with just a nice casual pair of boots that are comfy to walk around in. I've worn these like everywhere. These are from like, Nasty Gal a couple of years ago. And here we have it. Here is the Hogwarts outfit of the night. I definitely want to get a picture in this. Am I potentially going to freeze? Maybe. Do I care? Not really. I run really, really hot, honestly, so I think I'll be completely fine. But I probably will put a pair of leggings in my purse just in case, in case I need to change. But here is tonight's outfit. So fun. All right, got my bag all packed and I'm gonna do my advent calendar before I leave. I've been really bad about doing my advent calendar in the vlogs this year, but it's just, listen, I didn't even finish my main channel video that I was supposed to be editing today. Like I'm really kind of falling behind and I'm just trying to give myself grace for that instead of being like, oh, you're failing. Like you're falling behind because of how busy you are. Yeah. Oh, okay. So anyways, okay. Gonna do my advent. Our friends are almost here. So here we go. 12 days of beauty from Macy's. Number seven. Here we go. Oi, coming. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Oh my God, you guys look so cute. Hello. I was just showing my advent calendar to my Vlogmas. Our friends are here. Yay. So today I got a Hello. tightening neck cream. Hey. Okay. They know I'm getting old. Okay. We'll reconvene in a moment. barely but I didn't know until Noel just told us that um, the park actually closes at 7 and it's like 
after six. <laughs> so we didn't really realize. We're so we're actually, it. we're booking it to Hogwarts. We're gonna have like a drink or two. Just get all the festive vibes in, take some photos, and then head to like the city walk, which is where we're walking through right now, which is kind of like downtown Disney or Disneyland. Like it's attached to it and there's like shopping and restaurants and stuff. So we're gonna do that and uh, just make the most of our time, right? But first, drinks. But first, drinks. <laughs> to go to there. Wow. First stop. Uh-oh. Is it closed? Say it ain't so. Oh, okay. Oh, I was gonna cry. Yes! Well, horrible news. They're closed. The bar is closed. So I think what we're gonna do is like walk around here for like 10-15 minutes, take some pictures, and then just dip and go back to the city walk. I'm gonna do some magic though. Wish me luck. I brought my wand. Don't you worry. Okay, here's my target, and here is the shape that I need to do like with my wand, like an H. Yeah, here let I me go. get on this side. Okay. We're ready. I did it. Where? It moved. He did it. She grew. She's gonna go back down. Bye that bye. I'm so excited. It's so fun. Noelle got her butter beer. Is it nice and frothy? It is. I asked for extra calm. Like, unfortunately not. Oh. <laughs> okay. But, you know. We're having a great time so far. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lumos. <laughs> Cute. I feel like we're really in a back alley in England. <gasps> the three broomsticks. That was my warm up, that was my warm up. Big reveal, big reveal. <gasps> the chocolate frog. Chocolate frog. Oh, he's riveting. Ribbit. Okay, bye. Bye, bye. <laughs> Come on, you got this. Yeah! That's a big V! Yay! Come on! Yeah! I don't even need a watch. Okay, here he goes. Team Ravenclaw. All this place is making me want to do is just go back to England. Like, that's all I want to do. Swish and flick. It's already going. Good job, Noel. Yeah! Powerful witch. You're a wizard. What? Lights! Oh god! Oh my god! Happy Christmas, Harry. Happy, happy Christmas. <laughs> Honestly, Definitely. this night is fantastic. Like even though we only get to walk around for like 20 more minutes, it's amazing. To our next plan of action. Cause y'all knew I'm a Disney adult, but I'm also a Harry Potter adult, sort of. And I think what we're gonna do is this get is some... <laughs> Cashmere? I see someone's got a flair for fashion. Yeah, what else? So I think we're gonna get some house merch. Cause we have a Slytherin, two Ravenclaws, 
and a Gryffindor. We actually are missing a Hufflepuff, but Drew says that he thinks I'm secretly a Hufflepuff. Whatever, we'll just pretend it's rounded out. Change of plans. We actually didn't get any scarf because they were $40 and that just felt like a lot. We were saying if we were gonna be here for longer, like if we had another few hours to walk around, maybe we would, but maybe like after the holidays. So we're saying adios to Hogwarts on our <laughs> supposed to be Hogwarts date night, but it's still date night. We're just doing something else. <laughs> no one goes, bye. But we did some magic. We got some butter beers. And now we're gonna get some real beers. Bye Hogwarts. Bye Hogwarts. Until next year. soapy snow during this vlogmas and I'm very happy about it. Happy holidays! <laughs> All right, we have left Universal, we shut it down, and now we're going to the Fox and the Hounds. We were inspired by the Hogwarts vibe, so we're just gonna keep it going with the pub. <laughs> We got a scotch egg, we got some fried pickle spears, and then what is this? Mozzarella, uh, yes. Don't mind if I do. Mm. It is so good, wow. It's like so crispy and like beer battered. While we were eating, we heard someone come over the intercom and say that there was a trivia. So we got sucked into trivia, obviously. We're on round three of five. And our team name is Scott's Tots. If you're familiar with that episode of The Office, then you know. It's the most tragic episode of The Office. It's horrible. I can't watch it. I can't either. I can't watch it either. We've watched it like once since we started dating. He loves it. He loves watching it. Yeah. I love it. I love the dinner party. He loves it. It's too uncomfortable. Airline gives its planes saucy names such as Misbehaving, Lady Love, and Hot Lips. Hot Number four, lips. which airline gives its planes saucy names such as Misbehaving, Lady lips. Love, and Hot Lips? Yeah. It's gotta be there. Got the common thread. This current round that we're doing, there's a common thread between all the answers. What type of Olympic athlete would be able to perform a Robin Hood? Number five, what type of Olympic athlete would be able to perform a Robin Hood? We figured out the common thread, but we're just still trying to figure out the answers.
All right, everybody, we are now home. It is 9.37, so not too late. And actually, we only each ended up having like one or two drinks tonight. So it was a very mellow night. And it was one of those nights where like nothing was going to plan. Like we got, it took us an hour, similar to the last vlog, like LA traffic, especially during the holidays is gnarly. So it took us an hour to get there. And then when we got there, we only had like 45 minutes of the park being actually open. And so every Everything was like already starting to close down but we were able to like walk around and do a couple things so that was really really fun and then we just found like a random pub to get dinner and stumbled into a trivia game we ended up tapping out for trivia it was like taking way too long and it's like a school night for all of us I mean we all have to work tomorrow so it's fine but it was a really really fun night and like I love spontaneous nights like that where we just don't really know where the night's gonna go but we do our thing and we just had a great time with our friends and it was our last time seeing them before the holidays and it's just crazy like it's crazy that it's already mid-December I literally can't believe it I'm just sitting here holding this TL Advanced Tightening Neck Cream by NIA114. And I'm just like, neck cream? Am I really there yet? <laughs> this is from my advent calendar earlier. It like knows that I'm getting old apparently. Did you see that I got neck cream? <laughs> I think it's for like wrinkles on your neck. So if you need some. <laughs> We're just laughing over here. But anyways, it was a great night. And now we're gonna head to bed and that's gonna do it for this vlog. I don't think this is a super long one, but honestly, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired and I'm still having so much fun. We have three Vlogmas days left. That's crazy. And then it's Christmas time, right? Oh my God, that's weird. So we're gonna make it fun. We're gonna make it festive. We're gonna do our thing. I just feel like they're getting more and more festive each time, but I'm definitely looking forward to some at-home time. We have had a lot of social plans this week and I am very much looking forward to just like chilling this weekend, hanging out at home, making some mulled wine, baking some Christmas cookies, watching some Christmas movies, just getting real cozy and I can't wait. So thank you for being here. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time for Vlogmas number 10. That is literally crazy. Good night.